everyone, it's Madison, so today's video is going to be a very exciting one. Um, as you may or may not know, Glossy has a new product out called Future Do. It's an oil serum hybrid, and I have it right here. Um, I ordered it online, it retails for $24, and um, yeah, I have it. So today I'm going to be doing a review slash first impressions on this product as well as a full basic glossier because why not get into the full glossier spirit so yeah if you want to watch me use this and um, my other glossier products and just keep on watching okay so here we go so like I said before this retails for $24 um, it is a oil serum hybrid and you're supposed to apply it um, all over the face as a part of your skincare routine and you can also put it on top of your foundation as well um, so all I have on my skin right now is toner, so I'm going to, I guess, apply this on right now. So it says to apply two pumps all over the face, so we'll do one, two, and the color is like a milky shade, um, kind of pinky pearlescent, so, ooh, the smell is like really yummy. And it does feel like a serum. It's on the thicker side, but not to the point where it's like uncomfortable on the skin. So, wow. I don't know if you can see that on the camera, but there's like massive shine on my face. I kind of love it. Um, yeah, it's kind of smells like their rich moisturizer. Kind of love it. Um, but yeah, that's how it looks. First impressions. Kind of loving it. It's really pretty. The glow is like insane. My nose is dewy, my cheeks, everything. Um, so yeah, I guess this is my first impressions. I like it. Uh, let's get into the full face of Glossier. Um, so first we're gonna do the priming, no, no. First we're doing the perfecting skin tint. I have it in the shade light. Um, just shake it up a little bit. And I use my fingers for it. I'm just gonna do some drops on my fingers like 10 drops and then distribute it onto my face now this is definitely very light coverage like it pretty much just covers up some redness but still lets your skin peek through and I love that so my skin tends to be a little more the red side um, like my cheeks were always super red so this just kind of tones it down a little bit without making it look like really intense now I'm gonna use the stretch concealer in light I love this stuff so much like it's honestly one of my favorite concealers it is again so emollient and so glowy and it just it covers pretty well too so I put it under my eye of course and on my eyes too or on my eyelids because I do get kind of veiny there wow I don't know if you guys can tell but like my skin right now is so glowy and usually the stuff like their normal like skin tint and their concealer is pretty glowy but there's like a different type of glow on my face right now I kind of love it have a little pimple down here um, I'm just going to cover it not completely, but just making it look a little bit less noticeable. Okay, so now that my skin is mostly done, I'm going to apply some of the powder. Have it in the shade light. Just going to set the under eyes and the eyelids. Then we'll do some mascara using the Lash Slick. It's honestly my favorite mascara. It is so amazing. Like I literally love it so much. And 
now my lashes are all covered with some mascara um it's so pretty i love this mascara so much next i'm going to do some blush um i'm going to use the dawn cloud paint it's like a really pretty orange color take the tiniest amount blend onto the back of my hand and pat it onto my cheeks just to enhance the color of my cheeks a little bit um because i love the little blush look you know super cute And then also on the nose a little bit too. Do they cute too? So cheeks are done. So I'm not gonna do any um, any highlighter because I already have that super do on and my skin is super glowy already. So we're just gonna leave that be. Um, next, I want to do my eyes. Uh, I kind of did it out of order. I was supposed to put on my lid star for my mascara, but it's fine. I'm using the lid star in Lily. It's just a really pretty purple color. And we're just gonna go around the mascara. I don't know why I literally forgot to do my eyes. Um, put a little purple on and lightly blend it out. Not too much because if you blend this too much you can blend the color away and then you like go into another layer and it's just, just better if you blend it a little bit lighter than usual. There it is. It just adds a little bit of something to your eyes. And then for my eyebrows, I'm going to use some clear boy brow. Um, I use the brown ones sometimes, but today I'm just feeling like doing clear. And the final step we're going to do is some lip gloss. I'm going to use the red lip gloss from Glossier. This is my favorite one. I love the clear one. I love the holographic, but I think I prefer the red one the most. Like, just the color is so beautiful. So this is the final look. Overall, the future do, I'm obsessed. Like, this is the only glow product I have on right now, and my skin is so glowy, and I feel like everything applied so nicely over it. Um, the scent is super nice. Um, I don't notice any bumps on my skin. Because um, usually whenever my skin is sensitive or something, I get bumps like pretty close to after I apply it. No bumps on my face. So this is really good for my skin. Um, I love it. I think it's so pretty. Definitely if you um, are looking for a new glow product, I definitely recommend this. It's so pretty. And the packaging is like the prettiest ever. So yeah, I love it so much. And everything else in this video, I absolutely love. Um just looks so glowy so yeah thank you all for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed it let me know if you end up buying the future do or anything else i use in this video in the comment section down below so yeah bye guys see you guys soon